Okay, so I'm just gonna quickly clean this and then quickly put the new transfer that's called Geo Dog. It's a B size eight and a half by eleven, which I've already started cutting. So I'm just gonna finish cutting it off to the side. And this is a really cool thing is all it is is water. I let it soak for a little while only because I've had it on there for a good couple couple weeks. Um, it was a, a Valentine's day -ness. So all you need is a little water, a rag, here we go. Dun dun dun, we're in away. Hi, Jessica. Okay, so this was Chalkology paste from Chalkator, which I became a designer back in October. The company went public, has been public for about a year. They just a launch to the public July 1st, 2017. And they had a new product launch not too long ago. It, they did it in two waves. So first wave was um, February 6th and the Geo Dog was released. Then, along with a couple of the paste and new, I'm sorry, new inks. Yeah, that's right, inks. But we're just going to stick with them. The uh, Chalkology paste right now. Okay, so. Almost there, corner. Okay, so. All clean just making just a little bit because this isn't an actual trucking surface there is a little bit of clouding of the design that I had which is easy to get rid of just need um, magic eraser tends to do it but because this is just me that I just am putting out and whatnot I'm not the really don't really mind about it because you can't really see it far away. So, so we are gonna do the dog in custard paste, and I'm not very good with this angled squeegee, but I'm gonna try this angled squeegee. So I have just wrote dog up just so that when it when this transfers clean. I can put it on the backing correctly, if that makes sense. So I'm just going to take a corner, start peeling, and just straight down so that we don't stretch the transfer. I tend to do it this way, and then sometimes I will lay it like that and then pull but because I'm kind of stuck because the transfers are sticky yeah that's right which means they are repositionable and reusable and we're just gonna place it we'll place it there so because these are they're pretty detailed. So these transfers are like silk screen. So this blue part is just screen that ink or chalkology paste won't get in. 
So we really just need to make sure that there is no air bubbles in this little line part on this transfer. So I'm just going to rub it down. And then we're going to open our container. Which of course I was using this earlier and I can't actually... I got it! I got it, guys. I got it. Okay. So, what's really cool is they have this little lid, which means you always want to put this back on so that the paste does not dry up. And then you always want to stir it. And I usually have a makeup spatula, but you know what? We're just going to... Because I used this earlier, I'm not even going to worry. And yes, I got a little excessive on it. <laughs> but that's okay. Like I said, I'm not very good with this angled squeegee, so we're going to see how well I do. And then, of course, this is way too much excess. So we're just going to stick that right back in the thing. Okay. Going to swipe, go around, pull down and around. I'm so sorry. Twin just shared a post I did. <laughs> okay. And then going up, getting these. Okay. Making sure got everything, every screen part all covered. And this is all of our excess. So we're just going to squeeze that right in back of the container just gonna set that down and we're gonna take a corner if I can get it up <laughs> that's what she said and pulling and we're gonna lift all of this side up and ready for the reveal can I get heart or something cuz I see at least one views are still in. Any hearts, love, something? And because I didn't fuzz the transfer up, it's a little, a little harder. So I'm just gonna work it, try not to stretch my transfer. Almost there, guys. But look how cute it is. Aww. I just smudged it. Because it's not dry yet. It doesn't take long to dry these little tiny lines. But, of course, the clammy fingers trying to pull this transfer off. I messed it up. Okay. And then, yes, sometimes this happens. It's okay. So what we're going to have to do is usually there's a bucket of water to the side or the sink or whatnot. We're going to let that dry. We're going to set it to the side. And then I'm just going to put my lid back on. off the side right now they're still in the two ounce containers once the two ounce containers are going are being sold out they're moving into a three ounce container which means even more projects and you honestly don't need a lot of it I mean bigger projects are gonna use a little bit more but so usually you will want to put this in uh, water and I'm just gonna loosen that up and pull so you usually will want it to put it in a water right now I just have a spray bottle but that's okay so when cleaning this is like 
desperate measure. But really, you would follow the same kind of kind of rules. You would loosen up, get all the excess of that. And then you would pull it out of the sink or water, and then you would go in with a um, clean, Clorox disin disinfecting wipe. I just have Clorox, Clorox. And then what she would do is after you've let it and got the excess, you would just wipe it with a Clorox. I am so sorry. My Clorox disinfecting wipe is making noises and it's like farting noise. So you would just wipe all the screen part, and this is non-sticky side up. Then you would do, clean my little area, then you would do the sticky side, and do the same thing, wipe it down with Clorox, and then once you've done that, you would leave this to dry, sticky side up, because it once it starts drying, it will get the sticky adhesive back sticky again. And then you would just put this not on this side with the writing, but on shiny side once it's all dry. Usually, well, smaller transfers doesn't take too long, but it ranges. So I'm going to properly clean this because they were usable as long as you clean them properly. So I'm gonna go back to that after I close out the video. But, so it's Chocotour. I'll post my store link in the comments. And if you guys have any questions, here's the final project. It's gonna be all cutesy, just hanging out like that. So I'll post my, post my store in the links. Um, like I said, just wanted to do a short cleaning and designing right after. Um, but like I said, I'll post my link to my store in the comments. If you would like to learn more about it, comment me and I will get you information, possibly buying products or being on my team or just knowing more about the company and their products that they offer. And if you want to say VIP or join, I'll put you into my VIP group, which allows me to do incentives, deals, giveaways, stuff like that. Um, and feel free to look into this, look into my store. Um, okay, so project done. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to get better, I promise. And I'm going to watch Cars 2 with the twin now. So enjoy. Thank you.